So are we live now or what? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes, we are. This is Moments of Awareness with Peace and the Dudes on Sunday, February 17th. Yeah. Is it the 17th? Yeah, it is. Okay, thank you. And we're live here in Boise. We're going to show you our winter storm footage tonight. So, you can call us if you want to. Or you can just watch our cool winter storm footage. From two weeks ago? Yeah, sure Isn't was. Is that all it was? <clears throat> yep. Now that snow has been rained upon and it has melted and it has refrozen and it is hard as a rock. <laughs> Yep. It's cool though. It's starting to fall in in the creek finally. Oh, I should shut up and let myself talk. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then the thing is, the funny thing is, is that a couple days later we had a whole lot more snow, like a whole lot more. Right. I think it, we show it. I think we should get footage of it. Really? The two days later snow? Oh wait, maybe not. No, actually, probably not. I know I got pictures, but I'm not sure I got footage. Ah. <laughs> Guy. Uh. Guy. Guy. <laughs> Can you hear that out there? All right. be the only time you see us tonight. Look quick. <laughs> wow, that's loud, man. Uh, yeah, our son is jamming. I know. He's good, though. Look at that, man. Yeah. Yeah. Dressed up and did his own makeup tonight, huh? Yep. Isn't that awesome? <laughs> good paint job. That's what he calls it. Paint face. He wears a whole lot more than I do. Yeah. <laughs> That's all the stuff I bought that I never wear. <laughs> oh, funny kid. You probably have to remember that you have to watch the little light on the phone in case no, somebody actually does decide to call. I've been watching this. Yeah. But then if you don't, I guess. We'd miss out on an interesting phone call. No. <laughs> what? No. See, because that's the theme tonight. We've decided call now, we're live is boring. So we're going to go with B statements. Uh -oh. Tonight it's be interesting. Right. So if you call, be interesting or we'll hang up on you. And maybe <laughs> next week it'll be be funny. And maybe the next week it'll be be... Oh, hi. Hey there. <laughs> Me and my coffee cup. I, I couldn't help show us a little bit. That's all right. You know my ego likes it. Yeah, here, oh, look at this one. Here's a good one. Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> How are you tonight? We're good, thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe we'll hear from you a little bit. This is our winter storm 2008 footage. It's also available on YouTube, but not in this kind of resolution. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> Towards the end, you get some really awesome, like, look at our dog. Oh, poor girl. <laughs> and the, 
Let's see, you had driven the car in yeah. that morning, right? Yep. Yeah. yeah. That's cool, man. Your little table. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah. Hey. Oh. What are you doing? You know it's winter. Yeah, exactly. All my kids, all my friends' kids have RSV. That's a real bummer. Well, not all of them. I mean, a couple, but it's just a lot more than I know I've known of, like all at once. Yeah. Any other winter. Everybody has colds and flus and stuff, so I feel like we're doing all right if we just have a sniffle now and then. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> like, like we know, get the flu the old-fashioned way. Exactly. <laughs> just yep. catch it, and get it, get rid of it. Yep. Bella. That's our dog. She's Samoyed. And that other one was Bailey. She's our neighbor's dog, but she kind of lives with us like half the time. Right. We have joint custody or something. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Boise, how you doing tonight? Her family's just gone a lot more. And she's... Oh, look at her. Look how much fun they're having. Look at all that snow. And I'm telling you, we had a lot more after yeah. that. Lipstick? Yeah. Oh, you know what? I decided I should get my notebook out finally because, you know, I used to always carry my notebook to the show and write things down that were interesting. So I could remember people's names and, like, things that they told us. And, you know, because I have a good memory, but sometimes you just have to write things down for reference. It's right. smart. So I wanted to say we watched, well, I watched Survivor Man. He hasn't had a chance to watch it yet, but our friends from over at the college asked if we'd watched it. So um, I watched it and I was really impressed. That could have been the saddest day of my life. Watched what? What'd you watch? Survivor Man. Oh, right, right. Yeah, yeah. I, I haven't seen it yet, so. No, I saved it for him, but. Yeah, I saw it on the DVR, so. <laughs> I mean, it was a very frank look. It wasn't like there was no sensationalism. There was no... I look forward to you seeing it because I think you'll really like it. Yeah. Um, there were a couple of things in there that I should have written down. Now, see, I didn't. And you can never remember when you're on the air. See, all of you callers can relate to this. You call and then you're like, um, I thought of something interesting. And now I don't remember what it was. Right. <laughs> was, all of a sudden, this like weird music came over us, man. <laughs> it was like angelic or something, man. I just literally lost my train of thought. And then, um, I guess I'll sit up and look presentable in case you do show me tonight. He gave me all these, what he calls blankets to sit on. One of them is a shower curtain, and I'm sliding off the couch. But <laughs> that's okay. It's kind of a cool, interesting look. Anyway. Maybe he'll be a set designer when he grows up, huh? He seems to be really into that lately. Yeah, I know. The, the gels with the lights and everything. Yeah, it was, yeah. Um, and so then one of our, um, a debate I started yesterday because I knew I'd be gone this evening. Ha ha ha, just kidding. Wasn't even really just kidding, <laughs> ladies. <laughs> They watch this on YouTube, you know, sometimes. Right. <laughs> They'll be like, oh, you bitch. <laughs> bitch. That's okay, though. I've been a bitch all week. They know it. <laughs> one of them actually had the balls to call me on it, so that was cool. Yeah. Yep. yep. <laughs> and another one told me I was wrong. That was cool, too. I don't want to um, that landscape yet. Yeah, let me take some pictures of it. And I told her it was spin. Spin. People should know about spin in this day and age. It's all about the media. Oh, right. Yeah, totally. <laughs> totally, man. Like the media spin. You know, it's foolish if you're, if you're in the public eye not to try and present things the best possible way, but you need to be truthful about it, too. If you meant something bad when you said something bad, you should say, I meant something bad, and right. I'm sorry. And then you shouldn't do it again, because that's what makes you an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so then I put up this debate yesterday. Well, late last night, actually. So that it'd be up there early this morning, we could get into it, because I don't know if any of you participate in discussions about circumcision with people who have opposing opinions on the topic. Right. 
I was, uh, but I was young and I didn't have a choice in the matter. <laughs> well, it doesn't seem to have affected you adversely either. Uh, no, not really, man. <laughs> 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 Not at all. <laughs> My only thing with it is, you know, why alter the body if you don't need to? Yeah. If it needs to be done, then do it. Yeah. And if it doesn't, then for me, then yeah. don't do it. But right. I don't care if other people do it. It's their thing. You know. So the question was, which body modifications are appropriate or acceptable? Whatever. You get the idea. And my list was this. Tattoos, circumcision. <laughs> gotta wait for the dump truck to clear out. Right, right, right. You know how that is. Yeah. Beep, totally. beep, beep. Oh, it's going forward. So. No, that's later in the video. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. I'd rather do that every week. Awesome. YouTube it. Hey! Okay. Uh, veneers and tooth whitening. Uh, major <laughs> dental work, orthodonture. Plastic oh, yeah, surgery, yeah. and then I asked for elaboration if it's only parts of that, you know, that are okay and other parts that aren't. Uh, tooth blackening, which is a tradition in some cultures in which, you know, teeth are purposefully blackened, deadened and blackened. And people who haven't had it done are not considered marriageable and are considered ugly. Although that's changing, you know, with the media culture because we're kind of spreading our way <laughs> oh, over hey. the whole world. What? Looks like we might have a call here. Oh, Hello. hey. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Hello? Hi. Are you there? Hello? Hello? Are you there? Hey. Uh, must have hung up. Hello? Did we, di we didn't get the boy yoing? Hey. Yeah, I guess. Uh, oh. oh, well. They hung up too quick. Okay, well. Hey. Go? Go. Piercing. Oh, sorry. <coughs> Excuse me. Stretching of skin or lips, stretching of necks, and by that I mean with the rings that they apply to their necks so that their collarbone gets stretched down. And yeah, it's no well. You know, and then they you can't hold their it? heads up no. anymore after a while. Right. Uh, foot clubbing, which I found out that that was because a particular emperor found his wife, I think it was his wife or concubine, I don't know, um, but he found her clubbed feet so attractive <laughs> sexually that um, they it became this big tradition and high class women had it done to to be more attractive. Right. Which and then you look at the way that the feet are distorted and it's just like, oh my God, why would anybody do that? But mm -hmm. you know, if it's uh, that's the thing. That's the thing. Are these things acceptable? And you know, like if they're not. Is that our culture? Are we right or wrong? Does it matter? You know, I'm just kind of curious about these things. Another one was head molding. And then, of course, the infamous other, because every poll must have an other, except if it's an election ballot, because you wouldn't want to have an other option there and give people a real choice, <laughs> because that would be frightening. What would people do if they had a real choice? Oh, my gosh. Hi. Oh, I don't know. Snowfall, snowblow. Yeah, that's our. That's the last couple of weeks ago. And that's all the Kate. interesting stuff I wrote down because I only started on Friday or Saturday. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I don't have anything else but that. But I'm sure that we can. Uh, well, we have this great video. Yeah. And and like I did, we did both do some commentary on it. So. Right. There's a little. I guess we can't hear us right now. Uh, well, here. Um, but we have your awesome soundtrack, which I love, so. Woo! <laughs> then we've got the. Ah. Then we've got the. <laughs> That's for Spike Ferriston. Yeah. <laughs> I love this slow feature on here. Yeah. Which is not Buddy, a slow-mo. Gentle. Gentle. <laughs> oh, Everybody's going, man, we want to see the oh, video. Oh, look at that. Hey. Grave digger. Hey. Can we show that? Hey. Uh, Grave digger. 
<laughs> we are like now. they're going to object. Yeah, Dennis right. Anderson's still out, notably. Bigger? Bigger what? Bigger snow? You're doing good, though, bud. Oh, we gotta keep an eye on the phone too. <laughs> oh yeah, someone might call. Right, right. But you know, asking You're to be interesting is—is okay. is, that's a hard one. Mommy can't. Right. Okay. People <laughs> think that's hard. It's like no, just like tell us about your day. Right. Your day was probably interesting, even if you didn't really do anything. No. Because really, like if you're sitting around on your couch all day picking your ass, you know, or your nose or whatever, I don't know or watching TV or whatever it is that people do when they're sitting around on their couch all day. They're still usually like right. thinking about stuff. Cool. And they think, well, I thought of that while I was on my couch in my underwear, so it doesn't count. It's like, well, why not? Right. You know? That's the whole point of this show. You can be on the couch in your underwear thinking about things. And someone out there will find them interesting. You don't believe me? Try it. <laughs> <laughs> or don't. You, you want to see our show? Yeah. See us? He, he likes to see us. Yeah. It's our show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's the creek. Yeah. Isn't that pretty? Two shovels. Oh, done. Yeah. You parked it in the shed. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Two shovels, yeah, at home. And the thing is, it's like that everywhere. It's not like just drifted and stuff like that. Look at those. Ice. Mm. Icicles, Ice. yeah. Ice. Yeah, icicles. If you can't tell, I love it. We feel really fortunate. <laughs> I wanted to say hi to Sarah. When we started again, we'll have a Missed you this week. Mommy. <laughs> I know, I have a phone. I do pick it up on occasion. <laughs> and I yeah. will one of these days. Yeah, you're better, better at email. Email is a much better medium. Well, for me, but Mommy. not for everyone. Mommy's out in the I really try to be considerate of that. It's just, I have to, I have to figure out when I'm going to have two or three hours to be on the phone. Right. And that's not always easy for me to figure out. Right. So I'll miss an opportunity because I think that it's, you know, I think that right. if I call someone, I'm going to end up busy the whole time, you know, which mm. I always find kind of frustrating when I'm on the phone. Right. But I try to be patient, but still, it's like I don't want to waste their time, so I try to pick a good time, but that makes me wait too long. Yes, babe, water? Yeah. This is your water. He asked for water at the fast food joint tonight. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Jason gave it to him. Jason made us our shakes. They're awesome. <laughs> yep, exactly. and he even took it. Oh, hey. oh call. Hello. Oh. Hello. <laughs> hey, Hello. how you doing? We're doing good. What's, what's this show about? I'm here in the, the Mercy Medical Hospital. Oh. Watching you guys. You're, oh, Are you in the hospital? Yeah, fortunately. Can I ask what for? Uh, I have Crohn's disease. And Crohn's? Been, yeah, I've been a little bit low on potassium. And That's the bowel thing? Yeah. Wow. I, yeah. <laughs> I'm only 26 years old, too. Wow, that's pretty young. Yeah. Do you spend a lot of time there? Um, well, it seems to be about once a year. Wow. Yeah, so I've had two surgeries and everything for it. I don't wish it upon my worst enemy. Oh, I hear you, man. <laughs> well, that's basically what our show's about. Talk about stuff, huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah we just talk to people <laughs> about uh, whatever's on their mind and what's going on. and. Sometimes you know, we show some home happening. video. Because yep. everybody loves home video, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is, oh, uh, my son wants to change it back to the snow. Yeah, he's he, he's learning there how to run is. the control room, so. Yeah. How did you guys, is that your guys' control room? Oh, no, this is the um, local TV, TV. cable access TV TV okay. control room and studio. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting, see? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's our watchword tonight. Be so interesting. How did you, you guys decide to just do this? I mean. um, a long, long time ago, we did a show for another lady, um, huh. and we liked doing that, but we wanted to do this. So we yeah. did this for a while, and then we moved, so we didn't have facilities, so we didn't do it for a long time. Yeah. And now we're doing it again. And I don't really remember what made us think of it, except that we thought it was the one way to really kind of talk to people and let people talk to each other and yeah. just kind of 
what's the most interesting thing that's happened on the internet? Oh, our show is called Moments of Awareness with Peace and the Dudes. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, that's just our theme for tonight. Be interesting. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, the most interesting thing that's happened. Okay, be careful. Hmm. I don't know. Some people thought that our wedding was kind of a highlight, but we couldn't do it on the actual day, so we had to record it the day before and then show it. And that was our first day back in the studio after one hiatus. <laughs> Um, and no one ever thought it would happen because the first time around we were always like, oh, we're never going to get married, never, never going to have kids. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know, that was kind of interesting. The most interesting things that happen are, are usually just things that happen along, along the way. What? Oh, I just, nothing. Blue. You know, yeah, yeah. like that. <laughs> like the screen turns blue. Yeah. There we go. Or you call and, ah. and you know, you tell us a little bit about what it's like to live with Crohn's disease. Yeah, it's not fun. It's just amazing. It's not fun. No, it's not fun. Yeah. I actually dated a, well, actually I was engaged to a guy that had it um, hey, many years ago. Oh. Okay, yeah. okay. Uh, the constant fight, really. I mean, pardon? The constant fight. Uh, in, in and out, you know, the hospitals always have to watch it. I have to eat. I mean, it's not fun for a 26-year-old to have. I mean, yeah. maybe like an 8-year-old <laughs> <laughs> being a home or something. Oh, I, mean, uh, I don't think it'd be fun for anyone. <laughs> no. I don't care what age. Mommy. Mommy's so, out so that's you, what are your kind of, you guys in, uh, with you for fun, I mean, besides your That's job. pretty much what we, see, that's what we've been doing the last couple weeks, Mommy. right there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is that here in, in Boise? Or? Uh, that was up, up in the mountains, yeah. Oh, uh, okay. She's out there. You guys kind of nature people, too? Kind of nature people. Yeah. Well, I uh, guess we you could say that, but we're kind of techno people too. So. Oh yeah. Right oh on. yeah. We we love nature, but uh, who do you love you? technology too? You know. Like who? <laughs> like what kind of techno? I mean, drama bay, jungle. Uh, whatever. You know, we kind of happen to be listening to or playing or whatever. I make a lot of noise with this thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm a I'm a big music fan myself. Cool. Yeah, I'm cool. really into electronica and all that good stuff. Oh, 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 okay. I kind of got, I meant technology like computers oh. and like um, oh, yeah. that kind of stuff, but, but, so, but that said music to you, is that like a, is that like a musical genre? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, kind of like uh, drum and bass, uh, dance, you oh. know, most people go dance or club. Yeah, it's kind of, yeah, they play it in the club okay, a lot. Okay, see, yeah, yeah so. no, see, I know what that is. I just didn't know how I, okay, I see, how, I see what happened there. Yeah. All right. <laughs> um. <laughs> but technology, yeah, definitely technology is always something interesting. I'm always watching everything on what's developing. I'm an avid watcher of Discovery and Discovery Channel, Science Channel, all yeah. that stuff. Yeah, yeah we, I've been, we watch the History Channel and yeah. Modern Marvels a lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Stuff, yeah. 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 <laughs> Yeah. Uh, what about like, uh, what do you, do, like through your political views on stuff? Because, you know, me, I have a Crohn's disease and medical marijuana is like a big thing for me. But, you know, Idaho is just not going to happen, it seems like. You know? uh, probably, probably not for a little while, but, yeah. you know, things are, things are changing a lot lately, we, you know. You know what I think has to happen there is that I think that, I think that the, the tide just needs to finish turning. Yeah. It's, it's, it's at the point now where... Kind of like the domino effect. We yeah. Eventually, gonna get there, but whether what time we get there, is, we have to find that out. Everyone's affected by it one way or another. Everyone knows someone who should be able to use it or yeah. would do better using it. You know, I don't know hardly anybody anymore who who doesn't know of someone who would benefit. Yeah. So you know, at some point that reaches you know high enough up in the ranks and people start to go, well, we better do it. <laughs> yeah, so it's definitely a lot better than some of the prices on the medicines we have. So, like for me, I mean, it's just outrageous, 300 and 400 bucks a month just to pay for my medication. And right. With no insurance, that's right. a killer. And it tends not to be as effective from what I'm no. told. Yeah, yes. exactly. No not as effective yes. as the other. Oh, okay. Um, sir, I need to uh, change yes. his pants at the moment. <laughs> oh, okay. Here, we'll, uh, we'll go back to me in the uh, uh, video. <laughs> yeah, you guys chat. Change. I'll be back pants. momentarily. How old are you guys as a kid? He's three and a half. That's, oh, okay. Yeah, I dude. I thought two around him. Yeah. yeah. Just, dude Junior. That's our, yeah. <laughs> that's our son. If it didn't yeah, catch I, this. Myself, I have a five-year-old and a three-year-old girl. Oh, cool. Cool. Yeah. 
Yeah, they're, they're definitely fun people. Yeah, right? lots of energy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where they get it from, man. I'm yeah. <laughs> like, I gotta start working out again just to start barely keeping up. Yeah. <laughs> he's uh, he still wants me to carry him around a lot, and that's you know. Yeah, I know he's too big. Huh? Yeah, he's getting there. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta keep cut, keep cutting them trees up there in the mountains. So yeah, where where is that in the mountains again? Is That's uh, we're we're halfway between Idaho City and uh, and Boise. Oh okay. So we're about thirty eight hundred feet. Okay. So then you guys coming down and do your show? Yep. Like, during the weekend or? Yeah, just Sunday. We're on Sunday uh, every Sunday unless weather permit. This actually we were snowed out a couple weeks ago because of this weather. Oh yeah. And that's I what we're showing. Yeah, we got. Most uh, I've seen it snow since I've moved here to Idaho. Yeah, it's a lot of people. Same here. We're we've been here about uh, two and a half years, and uh, but from Minnesota, so it's oh, not yeah. not unusual. But uh, it's been kind of from what we hear, it's been pretty mild winters out here lately. Yeah, it has been. Well, I've lived here five years, but I've moved. Colorado. So oh, no kidding. Okay. Yeah. yeah, my brother lived out there. I used to I used to go to spring break in uh, A Basin was my favorite spot. Oh, Rapo Basin. Yeah, yeah, I loved it. Keystone, my buddy, uh, he, he worked out at Keystone for a number of years. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so. Yeah, that's a good place. I like it. I wish I could go back. Yep. Yep. I, yeah. I'm. I'm actually really. We're really happy to be here. I know. Uh, Peace lived out here about uh, 19 years ago, and uh, and fell in love with it. And she met me, and I always said I wanted to live in the Rockies. So. Yeah. She said she showed me a she showed me a picture of Stanley. Yeah. <laughs> was it? I was hooked. Yep. But I'm I'm glad we're you know we're close enough to town yet we're still up in the mountains a little yeah. bit. Yeah. You know. Yeah, I but, love uh, nature. No, I love the nature. It uh, it gets a little crazy up there. <laughs> <laughs> so how did you guys do, I mean, started doing the show. I mean, how do you just sign up and just let anybody do it? Or I mean, yeah, you you get uh, there. You there's like a sixty-five dollar year. And, well, there's different memberships depending on what you want to do, and yeah. and uh, they, then you take training to like we want to use the studio, so we took training on the yeah. studio and. It's just, you know, you pick a slot that works and that's free, and <laughs> if yeah. you want to do a show, you do a show. <laughs> yeah, it seems interesting. I just watch this. I mean, I don't really, I don't know. I usually watch, like I said, Discovery Channel, Science Channel. And sure, yeah. But Same now here. I'm, hospital, so I'm going through all the channels right now. <laughs> yep, flipping channels. And, oh, my God, it's a live call-in show. What the heck? Yeah. <laughs> but you can tape something, too. Right. You know, if you yeah. don't, yeah. It, it's all, it's all, you know, you and have you access. you want to talk about. Yeah. Bring out a hobby. You yeah, that's what I'm, I'm liking about it, you know? Yeah, <laughs> like little, little birds <laughs> and trees. <laughs> <laughs> that's a red-breasted nuthatch. hatch. <laughs> yeah. Well, right on, guys. So every Sunday night, you did? Every Sunday night from 11 to midnight yep, 11 on, to on midnight. Channel 11, yep. Okay, I'll have to keep on watching. I'll get off the phone now. All right, oh, well, well, thanks um, so much for calling. Yeah, give us a call and let us know how you are. Yeah, I will. Okay, yeah, awesome. definitely. Hang okay. in there. Oh, yeah, my name's Jim, by the way. Jim? Jim from Nampa, yeah. Jim, oh. good to meet you. Oh, let me write it down. Jim, I brought my notebook Thanks for calling, Jim. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, have Jim, a great night. All right, yeah, you too. Bye. Bye. <laughs> no, bud. I got this. Yours is at home. You need to bring it next time. You want to. Okay? okay. We'll bring yours next time so you can take notes too, okay? That. Bud, you can have it when I'm done writing this down. You getting a little tired? <laughs> no, bud. All right. I thought there was a notebook out, like out in the Over lobby. There. You know what? I have a notebook. Just a second. I actually forgot mine didn't I? Bud. These are the muses of psychedelic Easy. air. Oh yeah, psychedelic air, that's right. Many <laughs> years ago. So that was Jim from Nampa. There you Sorry go. to meet him. I wanted to, there's the bird. <laughs> I always think of, you know, 25 questions. As soon as someone hangs up, I'm always like, oh, you know what, I would have liked to know this. Right. So it's filming, but I don't know how to do that again. But, you know, that's why I brought my notebook, because I'm starting to remember how much easier it was to remember what it was I wanted to ask people. 
This is birdies in the trees. There you go. Look at that. Look at this. <laughs> that's a white-breasted nuthatch. Okay, that's what I was wondering. Isn't yeah. that cool? Yeah. I love that little fella. Or nature photography. <laughs> Bye, Pete. Yes, babe? What, babe? What? Color? No, I wish you wouldn't. No, babe. Do you need some paper? Buddy, there's paper in that. That's for coloring in. <laughs> Bud. Bud. Okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at this. You can have mommy's book as soon as I write okay. this down. It's the 17th, is that right? Yes, yeah. Oh, see, this book has all the, see, all, it only has, it only has like the days on the page and then it has all these calendars for February 05, 06, 07, 08, 09, ah. and 10. <laughs> 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 at the top. And um, huh. so you have to look at the one for the year and then figure out the date on that, so. Anyway, so it's kind of weird. Oh, okay. <laughs> Jim from Nampa. So that was nice. Yeah. So, and then the rest of the time when people are calling us, we just kind of sit here and chat. And show our, you know. Show our home video. Home videos of, uh, you know, this. And I this think it's more interesting when people do call, but. Yeah. <laughs> At the same time, you know. But hey, if you want to see uh, what we see sometimes, and our moments of awareness, that's what you can watch. Well, and plus we do watch the show at home, and it is pretty amusing, so. We sometimes. laugh at ourselves quite a lot. <laughs> what? What? Yeah, no, we think we're funny anyway. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> la 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 la. Oh, see, that was nothing. It was all the way up to the eaves. Right, I know. Uh, by the time we were done. Right. That's what I was looking at. I'm going, hey, yeah, that's quite a lot. That's only like halfway up. Of course, that's, you know, that falls off our roof. So it's like twice as much as, as a lot of places. Like, well, no, probably more than twice as much, huh? Yeah, yeah. There's the date. <laughs> 23 <laughs> degrees out, 72 inside. <coughs> Excuse me. It's on the fourth, yeah. Um, huh. mm. No, I don't think it is twice as much because if you look on top of the little shed yeah. or on the top of the back of the house, huh, which caved in a little bit, um, right. <laughs> <laughs> not the back of the house proper, the little patio part, it's no big deal. Anyway, um, it's really five feet thick, five feet deep sitting, right. not drifted at all. Right, because this was, on this side, it was all the way up. Yeah. Know, past the uh, flower box. Now, now or before already? Now, now it is. Yeah. And that up there is yeah. <laughs> quite a bit deeper flag. even. Flag! Big flag! It will, it Big will really flag. be interesting to see Big if the trampoline flag. makes it through the winter. Right. <laughs> intact, or if it just collapses Big next year. Flag! Right. There's Big flag. A, that was a good yeah. one. Yeah. Oh, you get a kitty. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, did it fall? No, well, no, just how deep it was. Mm. That back window. Oh, yeah, I guess that was getting pretty good. Yeah, it's, it's, but it was in the back window. It's oh, over, that's the over. back window, right? Yeah, yeah, that's the back room. It was higher. Now that's completely closed. Yeah. Well, now it's actually opened up a little bit, and those big icicles all fell down. Yeah. Just one big, like, well, actually, two big masses that just, like, fell and, like, cracked. No. So. <laughs> yeah, it's melting a lot now, yeah. Well, it's, it's kind of, it's melting, but it's like not like melting down so much. Right. Because it's melting mostly from the bottom and like down into itself, so it's just like getting thicker and harder. Right. <laughs> cool. The creek is still pretty much covered. Yeah, yeah, there's some bigger spots now you can see. Yeah, and it's starting to fall in pretty good in those big deep. There areas. you can't see yet, but that's that side is now squashed down quite a bit. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if Bailey's been running after the quails up there. <laughs> okay, this is just cool. Yeah, we can't just watch have, this. Can't show you the inner sanctum. <laughs> just watch this. 
think I get a little bass action going here too. Yeah, turn your turn your turn your turn your TV up, your bass up. That's me in front of my Oracle. Did you turn the music up on? <laughs> <laughs> on the dude? No, not too bad. No, on on them, on the viewers. Oh yeah. You know our 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 six loyal followers and yeah. the three that have kind of flipped onto the station tonight. Right. When was the last time you looked at the phone line to see if it's? Oh, I've been watching it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> he Just fell in off. Case. The, he rolled off the stage a little bit. Oh. <laughs> I think he's starting to get mad now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's just a fun little sequence. Oh, yeah, and here come the, the plows and the grater. But still. But still. Yeah, because even when we put this on YouTube, it's not going to have the resolution that it has. No, you won't be able to see a lot of that. Yeah. This is third pass, remember that. This show is easy tonight. Yeah. <laughs> I'm doing all my talking for me. Oh, there goes right. the tree. <laughs> <laughs> there goes the tree. <laughs> I really should shut up. Oh, that's no, right. no, because I liked some of what I said. Yeah, I got some of the good diatribe later. I think I tried to. <laughs> Carpet, yeah. We might have reboot it down. But you're doing a good job. Yeah, well, you hope you don't get out of here. You That grater's like jamming up there, man. <laughs> Jeez, yeah. He was too, man. They had to, they had to move so much snow up there. That it's still, it's just crazy. And he's still, you know, he goes by every couple days just to scoop it out of the road. Right, and pack up the driveway again for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of funny right now because he had it all cleared out all nice, and then you know they come by, and it's like after a while he was just like, like I'm just, he just like basically scooped out a little niche they can get in and out of. Yeah. Big in enough for and the car. Out of. Yeah. yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the tree is just <laughs> Yeah, you can totally hear it cracking. I don't know if the mic picked it up, but Plus yeah. he took a really long time in front of the house. I think he liked being videotaped. So. Right, right. I think that's the guy from up the road, Scott. One of these two guys that runs one of these two machines, I think, is that guy. Yeah, he likes burying my driveway. Thanks a lot, Scott. Well, <laughs> yeah, thanks a lot. <laughs> well, that's if I but park... But he does... If huh? I, if I, oh, hey. <laughs> if I park the car up there, then uh, he doesn't hit it so bad. Hello, yeah. how you doing? Yeah, it's Jim from Nampa again. Well, hey, Jim from Nampa. You're probably our only viewer tonight. Yeah, Woohoo! Yeah. <laughs> just going to say... what. Die Don't hard you color. hate it when those guys just plug up your driveway? Yeah, yeah. Sit there and plow out everything else, but then just pile it right up in front of you where you need to get out. <laughs> oh, they, yeah. do, they do it purposely, man. I know yeah. he's sitting there like, ah! <laughs> and then I, you know, you try and get him back by throwing a couple little chunks in the road, and yeah. he's like, yeah, right. <laughs> well, uh, there's, I got trees sticking out of snowbanks and stuff. Now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well. So is that the studio there, then? You got the this is the studio. studio then, huh? Yeah, this is yeah, the, this is the that's studio. Cool. That's the studio. Yeah, I've seen this on a couple other shows, I think. This, this is the control room yeah. in here. <laughs> <laughs> Pay no attention to the man behind the... Wait, <laughs> yeah, I'm the one with the, the curtain. Of Oz. Yeah. <laughs> with the strange music. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I control your thoughts. Well, well, well you guys not really. to live up there, kind of away from... Because the of that? Exactly what you're looking at. Look at, at. that. Look at yeah, that. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah, you're right. You're right. <laughs> That's everyone asked me that too. They're like, you know, it used it, for a while there. They were like, oh, oh you get to snow blow this morning because I was every morning I was doing like an hour worth of snow blowing. Huh. 
and uh, and so they're all kind of chuckling and you know and they're like man I could no way I, I'd want to live up there and I think every time I drove through this it, every time you drive it it's a different it looks different it's yeah it's so cool plus you know he says uh, he says well I had a 40 minute drive to work and your your drive was 40 minutes and mine mine was looking at beautiful mountain scenery and yours yeah. was looking at what tail lights yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and smog <Yeah>. and buildings <laughs> <laughs> which, you know, are, which are beautiful in their own right. But I did have to snow blow and chop some wood. Yeah. 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 Well, he did because I can't throw this. Well, you know, I have not tried to throw the snow blower because I just don't think it would be wise mm -hmm. for me to try to operate that size of machinery. But yeah. Yeah, but it keeps him in good shape. Yeah, it's, I'm getting more exercise right now in winter than I ever do in the spring and oh, summer. I, I have a 40 pounder that I'm lifting up and down all the time, so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> do you, yep, do you, guys, right there. you guys work in Boise then? He does. I work at Micron, yeah. Oh, at Micron, okay. Yeah. It's yeah. a good job. Definitely. The night shift. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm a oh, night, 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 night walker. Yeah, I work at <laughs> Impact Wireless myself. Oh, okay. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. You Is know, that phones? I try to get them to switch over the company phone. Oh, sure. <laughs> yep. Yeah, good luck getting in the Micron. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> no, it's every three years. I know. Every three years they go to bed for their cell phones. So I already know. I yeah. tried. <laughs> yeah, I can uh, imagine. Sorry. Hey, at least you tried, man. <laughs> yeah. Looking flower. Yeah. Yeah. surprised. <laughs> it fell off the But yeah, I don't got that. I got that exciting drive of the taillight, you know, going in. Oh, yeah. Pamphlet of Boise. Yep. I had, uh, when I worked at, I worked at the, uh, uh, car dealership in Nampa at Edmark and uh, that was a drive. Yeah. Yeah. That was tough. <laughs> you okay. know, early but morning yeah. traffic. Where are right now then <laughs> to Nampa. Yeah, I love it now. It's uh, you know, it's a 23.5 mile drive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and you know, and I look at that most of the way. Yeah. Is there any hot springs up there towards your way? Uh, you know, we haven't seen any yet. I don't have any, any what? Hot springs. Oh, not that I'm aware of. Not up by we are where we are. No. I think. I wish that'd be awesome. <laughs> I know that's one thing. Me and my girlfriend and kids would love to go do that. I think up further on um, between Idaho City and Loman, I think. Or yeah, yeah. Yeah, Loman is the Kirkham Hot Springs, Bonneville Hot Springs, and all. Yeah, Bonneville, I think, is the one we went to when I was here early, and it wasn't 19 years ago, by the way. <laughs> oh. It, what? Wait a minute. Now, yeah. I guess it was. It was yeah. 89.90. So. Right. That's what I thought. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, well, you know. I actually, I was thinking, because I was, I was saying 20, and then I'm like, no, it's not quite 20, I don't think. No, it was April of 89, <laughs> we came out here, so. Right. Yeah. So you but, guys are, where did you guys move, where did you guys live in before I know there? Uh, North Carolina. Oh. But Minnesota yeah. before that. Yeah, we yeah. both Minnesota. grew up in Minnesota, yeah. Yeah, that's right, you said that. Yeah. But yeah. where we were when we didn't have cable access was uh, North Carolina. Yeah, yeah. I was stationed out there in the Marine Corps, so. Oh, yeah. for for Brad, was it? No, um, I was at New River Air Station, but Camp Lejeune, a lot of people hear about. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. I used to, well, I used to travel the country selling magazines door to door and all down the East Coast. Oh, no Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. From Boston to, you know, even North Carolina. I went to, a lot of the, the chicks, of course, went on to the Army bases. Right, yep. <laughs> yeah, that's Fort, Fort Bragg. That's uh, Fayetteville yeah. and stuff. How was that? Yeah, that was actually that. pretty fun. It was an experience. <laughs> I mean... Yeah. Luckily, luckily enough, I was on a good, because there's some magazine crews out there that are just scandalous. And, you know, right, those sure. are the ones you hear about. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But the one I was on, it, they were truly legit. I mean, you got paid, and if you wanted to leave, they paid your bus ticket to leave. And You want to know the coolest thing about that? Hmm. That just came up today. <laughs> just today on the group that I spend most of my days on, uh, Yada. Uh -huh. And... This lady was talking about she had somebody come to her door and the girls came in and told her some lies. This was one of the bad ones, obviously. Yeah. And the police showed up and it, just spontaneously, they didn't call them. Huh. And I know her, it's not something she would lie about. And uh, came and asked them a bunch of questions and they took the girls and questioned them. And I don't know what happened to them. I kind of hope that, you know, they don't go to jail. Yeah. Because from my understanding is that it's not that... They don't. They don't really go after the, the people selling the magazines. What they want to do is that's go after the, the head honcho, you know, yeah. behind it. That's really, you know, doing doing the bad stuff with the kids. You know, right. Them right. And not giving them the money or not doing permits or you know, right. Well, permits, yeah. If it's not a legitimate business, then mm -hmm. then yeah, then 
Yeah, it we were 100% legitimate business. That's we cool. For 10 months and one of the most successful. That's it, cool. it, it was very awesome, yeah, just being able to see all the places I've seen. My went, uh, you know, Boston was one of my favorites, down in New Jersey, to Delaware. To, we went through Delaware at the time that they actually <laughs> had the uh, sniper shooting. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, so we were all fighting over who was going to get out and pump gas. Right. Uh, we're, we're in Delaware, too. Yeah. <laughs> Where? Delaware. Delaware. <laughs> And from, from one of my favorite movies. <laughs> and then uh, South Florida was the craziest, and, and Fort Lauderdale. Oh, okay, you know, yeah, I bet. Beach, yeah. Party town. Yeah, Crazy party fun, town, or? No place to raise your kid, though. Right, yeah, no kidding, <laughs> right? Yeah, but maybe a place to go when you're not quite a kid anymore, and yeah. you're not, don't have any kids. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, we lived in uh, Pensacola, Florida, for a little while. Okay. Yeah. 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 But that's in the, like, that panhandle. Yeah, when then we went to uh, the Tampa Bay, and then we went up through there, and Dallas, and Houston, San Antonio, Austin. I love Texas. Texas is one of my favorites. Oh, yeah. But, yeah, Texas? That, that's an experience. I mean, yeah. you find a good one, and if you something that you want to do, it's just an experience in itself, just seeing that's different awesome. people, meeting different people from all over the country, and right. seeing how yeah. the city operates. And well... And see, those are the ones that people need to hear about, so that they, you know, so that they know that when it's legitimate, they should support those kids. Yeah, definitely. You know. Yeah. So is. this is cool because this will go on YouTube, and I'll have those girls go and watch it, and they can see that it's not always like that. Yeah, it's it's, it's not always like that, but I mean, I would say a good seventy percent of it is. You know. So what do you what kind of hints would you give somebody as to how to tell the difference? Well, I mean, you can just kind of tell because if there's a lot of like drug use, like say that there's. You're the manager, the boss is, you know, when a crackhead or something, get the hell out. <laughs> I mean, it's, you can kind of tell the way they do their whole interview process, too. I mean, but mm -hmm. but for the person who has a person come to their door, how can they kind of tell? Oh, if okay, I see what you mean. Um, you know, basically, just their story. I mean, if there's, there's, some, there's some companies that say that there are some, you know, they're trying to be a team leader for some ghetto children. I mean, those, any of those are going to be not, uh, you know, 100% legit. Uh -huh. Those ones are scam companies. Yeah, because she, she said she felt like she could, you know, she felt weird about it from the beginning because their story didn't match up and they didn't mm -hmm. seem like, you know, they, so, so yeah, you could probably just... What she can always do, too, is because there, as for every door-to-door -door salesman, there's uh, the policy that you have a three-day cool-off period, a three-day cancellation period. Right, right, so right. So if you were ever to buy one, they make sure you do get a receipt, and then you check up on the company yourself, go to the Better Business Bureau from wherever they're located at, right. and determine, you know, see if they've had a lot of complaints, and then if they haven't, then it's good, you know, you just keep the receipt. But if it's not, then you go ahead and you can't get the refund back for it. You can complain for it, and you can send it back to the company. Awesome. More than likely, they will... You know, send you a refund, or you might have to go through some additional hurdles. But right. I mean, yeah. you can pretty much just tell by the individual. Yeah. That's doing it. That's yeah. representing the company. If they're having a good time and they're enjoying themselves and they're and they're in good health and everything's yeah, exactly. cool, yeah. then okay. I mean, if they're not getting packed up by a beat up station wagon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. Because <laughs> see, my company, we had a, we had two excursions, we had two Eddie Bauer expeditions, and we had a suburban that we traveled around it. Nice. Right. These other companies, they had these cheap 15 passenger cargo vans that are broken down half the time for station wagons. Wow. You know, and you can just kind of tell the quality. Yeah. Old really beater obvious. vans that yeah. are smoking and rusted through. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. exactly. <laughs> see, that's the, th see, people are not stupid. People can figure these things out if they realize that the responsibility is in their hands. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. So that's my little mini rant for just this moment. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, like, like you said, you know, 70% of them, I would say, are going to be, you know, scam companies. And you know, you yeah. definitely need to investigate before. And, you know, some companies will actually, like our company, will they'll, pro, they'll go to this uh, city hall and get a, a permit to solicit door-to-door. Yeah. -door. And if they have that, then it's a legit company because the city's already checked up on it. Yeah. If they don't, I wouldn't buy it from them because they're going to get pulled pulled over by the cops later on <laughs> down the road anyways. Right. You know. And so. then your order, I suppose, your order goes out the window, huh? <laughs> yeah. Wow. Basically, because the cops will take everything and 
and no, yeah. you know, all the money and everything. Your money would be confiscated as part of the criminal investigation. I mean, investigation. sometimes I've heard, I've heard of the, them actually going back to people's houses and then the cops turning it back, you know. Well, that'd be cool. Well, respect. But if they're always asking for donations or saying, sending children's magazines to children's hospitals, more than likely they're going to be a scam. Right. Yeah. Because yeah. you know, that never happens. That's just trying to get extra money. And if they really try to push cash, right. you know, you pay in cash. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, Ben. Yeah. There, <laughs> there's the creek. <laughs> <laughs> there's what you can see of it. Yeah. Well, that's cool. He he closed one of these things back here and it fell over on a moment. Uh, not on him, but it <laughs> fell it fell over while he was closing it. Kind of scared him a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> that makes awesome. him cranky. You know how three year olds are. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a five-year-old and a three-year-old, but girls. Oh, are they different, you think, girls and boys? Yeah. My friends tell me they are. I don't know yet. Oh, so, <laughs> well, at least mine are. They kind of got a touch of tomboy in them, so. But, <laughs> yeah. I think that might be why that they're a little crazier than most girls, but. I don't know. I hear girls are hard. Yeah, I can't. No, I'm, I'm regret the day when they turn old enough to bring a boyfriend home. Like, regret yeah. it for me and, and the boy. Right. You know? Yeah, well, you know. Y'all get through it. <laughs> I look at my poor parents and I think, man, huh. I'm, I'm amazed that they still talk to me. Yeah. <laughs> no, I guess I wasn't that bad, but... You know, really, it, it always seems like we were on. <laughs> well, yeah. I mean, we feel like we're big rebels, right? Yeah. Ooh, look at me. I'm, I'm doing something I'm not supposed to. Thing to us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. Well, well, they're cool little people. It's definitely something to watch. <laughs> watch their personalities grow up, even if they, you know, grow up to be somewhat like you. And right. They, they, yep. they, they'll take you, and they take. Uh, you know, mom, a little bit of mom, a little bit of dad, and yeah. a little bit of them, and then they got a whole new person. And I know, it's fascinating, isn't it? Yeah. It you know? Is. And that's what we get a lot of our, you know, amazing and interesting people we have today, you know, just because it's a mixture of all the other interesting and amazing people we have in today's <laughs> Exactly. <world>. Exactly. <laughs> I totally agree. <laughs> hey, babe. I don't know if those are for playing with. We should look. So you, is that roof stayed up pretty good? Well, for because, the most part. Yeah. That that roof is fine because yeah. it just slides right off there. But the part in the back got yeah, a little. Yeah, the bit. other the other side's a little messed up. <laughs> well, in in the back, see On that the, back part yeah. there? Yeah. Yeah, that's just a little addition, I guess. And they the the a tree fell on the other end of it oh, last no. two springs ago. Yeah, and one, just kinda, one of them big ones. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And it kind of squished down a little bit, but but um, we got it shored up. But with this snow, there was just no way. No. So it kind of came down. I heard it one night too. Now see, this is for Jennifer. I heard it one night, and I told her we were chatting at Yada, and I said, you know, I don't know what just happened, but something either just fell on us or something broke. <laughs> And so I thought, and I looked, and I was like, well, it must have been the snow sliding off the roof. And then a couple of days later, I noticed that the back part was cracking there, and the, the wall was cracking away a little bit. So, ah, <laughs> now we'll have to fix it. But it yeah. doesn't look like it'll be too hard. Yeah. But I forgot to tell her that that's what it ended up being. She'll be all like, oh, no. <laughs> and I'll be like, it's no big deal. And she'll be like, I can't believe you. And I'll be like, <laughs> and now she'll watch this, and she'll be like, I'm not like that. <laughs> How many neighbors do you guys have up there? Pardon? How many neighbors? Well, you, you know, it, like per mile? <laughs> yeah. Because they have <laughs> about two or three, I guess. Yeah. Right? Maybe four? Yeah. Maybe five, ten, I don't know. Well, I don't know. People don't talk as much as they used to. Aw, you figure they wouldn't. Well. You know, you get in a more nature type place and smaller. Little town, you got your own little place out there. Most yeah. people are yeah. pretty friendly and wave well, by, you know, wave each other and have you pass by. Yeah, yeah, it's just kind of a, it's just kind of a slower warmth. Mm -hmm. You know, people just kind of wait to see first if you're even going to make it through a winter or two. Yeah. And then they kind of start to come out of the woodwork and they're kind of like, oh, well, they're still here. Maybe they're, you know. Not delicate little flowers. Yeah. Gonna run back to the suburbs. 
you know, but so more and more we see people and we talk and it's nice. Yeah. Our neighbors are all pretty decent people, I think. Yeah. <laughs> I hope. Uh, <laughs> I think most people's neighbors are decent people at heart. I think that it's just, you yeah. know, society is what it is right now and yeah. we uh -huh. make the best of it. Yeah, I've been... And I have to say, our only imperative tonight for Moments of Awareness with Peace and the Dudes was be interesting, and I think you've done a marvelous job, Tim from Nampa. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> well, I like, you know, yeah, I like the independent television. I like anything local, you know, and, and it's for, kind of perks my interest in even starting to do maybe a little show of something, of anything. <laughs> awesome. I think, I think you should. I think everybody should. Yeah. I would love to see public access be one of the lo most lu lucrative. What is? Now I can't even think. Three <laughs> nonprofit organizations out there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't. I think they had it, but it wasn't more open, like more public access. You know, it was, you had to have your own video equipment, and you had to have your own. Yeah, they just gave you, you a place to air it or something. Quite Which a bit one? of money, you know. Just to even get started on something like this, not you know, sixty-five dollars. Yeah, holy crap. I see it, bud. Yeah, this is probably the cheapest okay, place to get started. Get down there. Yeah. And yeah. um. Cool, what you could do. You know, there's a trade-off for it. It's not professional, but then we were watching Spike Thurston and today <laughs> that we had recorded last night and their audio kind of sucks too so yeah <laughs> we're doing pretty good with ours these days he's got it under control back there yeah kind of sort of if uh, this is the first time you've seen us then you probably didn't see all the audio disasters in the past no <laughs> <laughs> no like i said usually i never watch anything you know like 30 below on the, on the yeah. tv yeah <laughs> right and yeah now i'm skipping through it and I was like, be interesting, what is this? <laughs> <laughs> so I figured I'd give it a try. Well, this is just our little show that we do for no real reason except to talk to people in our local area, right. wherever that Bobby. may be. Yeah. And it's a lot of fun. Yeah, it looks like it. <laughs> <laughs> Even if nobody calls, I know a couple calls, of friends we're glad love to just, you know, fart off on a little show and we talk about stuff, whatever. <laughs> I have to say I couldn't hear that very well because he's kind of hollering and I. Oh, I said, well, I know, I, I know, me and a couple of friends, we could figure out yes. something, but just fart off about the have fun, talk or whatever. Absolutely, Put and you should. Put music on, music video, or whatever. Yeah, and you should check out, um, buddy. Please stop hollering, please, just for like two more minutes, please. Uh, you should check out on Friday nights at 11.30, uh, Smells Like Public Access. They're doing a little live thing, too, and they've got little skits and stuff. And oh, yeah. I think, I think that, yeah, it, it, I, I, ha I didn't get to see it myself because we don't get cable up where we are. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, I think that uh, that'd probably be fun, too. And that it might give you some ideas and some thoughts, and you guys yeah. might want to talk. And yeah. Because, yeah, I think everyone should do it. We, we just like showing home movies. <laughs> yeah, we're kind of boring and old, but that's okay. You know. Okay, it's, it's interesting. Interesting. <laughs> Got my interest, <laughs> right? Next week, we're not sure what it's going to be. And you know yet. what? Believe it or yeah. not, you're not the only one watching. Yeah. <laughs> hey, and I'd like to say hello to all our friends out there that I know are watching. Hey, you know your necklace <laughs> keeps hitting your microphone. Does it? Yeah. Oh no, I'm sorry. I did not know that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. See, that's what makes it interesting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, dear. Yes, dear. What? Play drums. Uh huh. Well, he's playing drums on the top of the ladder. Yeah. Uh, well, we got a couple. We get. got a couple minutes left. Uh, yeah. So I'll let you guys go and maybe catch you guys next. Oh, okay, well, that'd be awesome. That'd be great. Yeah. Thanks so much for calling again. Yeah. No problem. And it was. You're, you're peace. I'm That's peace. Peace. And they're the dudes. Yeah, all right. Oh, my, <laughs> my camera's dead. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. All right. Well, peace and dude. I will see you guys. Next week. All right. Awesome. Cool. Thanks. Great. We'll talk to you. Yeah. Congratulations on the show. Like Thanks. Thanks. Bye. 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 So this is moment. Wow. No work degree. This is uh, moments of awareness with peace of the dudes. I already got the bear poop. <laughs> yeah. I mean, and you can listen to the poop. dude. Oh wow. Take us out tonight. Most likely. Yeah. Well, and I've got. Uh, yeah, we got some. You got. Uh, hopefully, I got it. Oh, up. No. I hope I got it here. Oh, I hope it gets that. Oh my god. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs>
Hello? Hello? Feedback. Yeah. Feedback. Up, 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 up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> up, 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 up. Oh, it's off. We're off the air. <laughs> yep, I know. That was good. <laughs> no way. We need a camera anyway. <laughs> yeah. We need to lobby out I gotta wait for the credits. Yeah, Fox, pick it up. I love that we're interesting. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is for our YouTube exclusive. There's some things we need to lobby on the show. And it really like is for our YouTube exclusive because we didn't show it on the air. Like that, okay? Yeah, hurry, man. We're almost out of battery, dude. Yeah, we need new battery. Oh, we're right there. Okay. <laughs> the aliens are coming. Oh, come on. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, damn it. <laughs> two minutes, two battery, battery, battery. T, 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 up, 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 yours, up, yours, up, yours. Up, 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 there, up, there, up, there, up, up, there, up, there, up, up, there, 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 up, Shadow of the tree in the freaking snow. The last couple of minutes. Why is it always too long? <laughs> yeah, they don't yeah, yeah, care. Yeah, start. <laughs> God. Well, how do we make it too long so that we have enough footage for afterwards and then and still make it... Short enough for the credits? Still put the... Well, why don't we just put the credits like five minutes before the end of it? I could do that. That'd be better. Yeah, that's so going to fry the digital. Awesome. Anyway, so. <laughs> yeah, Not, 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 not